I built a tubular bumper support in the back. And that's a Midwest chassis parachute mount. And then the car is mini tub, Wolf mini tub kit, which was uh, probably one of the worst jobs on the whole car. It just requires so much cutting because you want to cut a little bit and test fit and cut a little bit more and test fit again because if you cut too much you know then you're kind of screwed but uh like i said it's got the mini tub kit in it and uh where the t-top cavity was or t-top storage area we cut that out entirely made this door it's got a 12 gallon Rhodes aluminum fuel cell in it and it's got two AEM 380 fuel pumps runs on E85 uh, each pump feeds 10 an to the back of each rail and it's PTFE the nylon hose still braided it's got a Midwest chassis short torque arm, Midwest chassis lower control arms, pan hard bar, weld in, anti roll bar, Midwest chassis 10 point roll cage. We added the actual X back there. I just sourced some tube locally and uh, we notched it and fitted it in there and welded it. But uh, I did opt for the rocker bars down here because. Uh, Originally, I intended on pulling the door bars out, which I did do, so let's come out that hole there, a little hole saw action. Figure if I was going to remove the door bars and have the swing outs in it, that, you know, a rocker bar was a pretty wise decision.